You got to feel so bad for Patrick Line right now. Line goes through the NHL assistance program and gets cleared to return to play on July 26, 2024. He was traded to the Montreal Canadiens for a fresh start on August 19, 2024. And the worst thing happened in a preseason game against Toronto. Just minutes into the preseason game, Line A was carrying the puck into the offensive zone and collided knee on knee with Toronto player Cedric Perry. Here is the clip. In the league in the penalty kill last season, 11th the year before. And now Line A's down and clutching knee. his right oh, knee. Boy. Or his left knee, rather. Line A's down. Hudson works it and shoots. Oh, He'll have got a piece man. of that. And Patrick Line A's down in a heap in the corner, oh. grabbing his left knee. Particularly fast. Just knee on knee. That's Paré who stands up and. Oh boy, that's a lot of flexion on that left knee. Cedric received no penalty for the knee on knee collision. Moments later, Arbor Shekai takes matters into his own hands. Here is the clip. It is so unfortunate for Line, eh? After all the hurdles he had to go through to get back to playing and for this to happen. I really liked the move Montreal made to obtain him. I had really high hopes for Line A and was looking forward to watching him play. Let us hope it isn't as serious as it looks and he has a speedy recovery. In the same game, star rookie defenseman David Reinbacher was also injured and left the game. Does the NHL play too many preseason games? I get that these games are used to see different line combinations or try out some rookies, but you almost always see an injury to a significant player during these games that mean nothing. What are your thoughts on preseason games? 